Rich, what do you have to say? I have to say, Edward Parker, come on down. You're the next contestant on The Price is Right. Edward Parker, front and center, please. Here's Edward. And now I do believe we're ready to see the next item up for bid. It's a lovely desk. This five-drawer oval desk and matching chair come from Palachik South Island Collection. The plantation hardwood and rattan construction is accented with a seagrass overlay from Palachik. Edward, you start the bidding, please. One thousand dollars. One thousand for Edward. What for Deanna? Eleven hundred and fifty. Eleven hundred fifty. Let's go to Sharon. Twelve fifty. Twelve fifty. Roslyn. One dollar. One dollar. The actual retail price is twenty-one oh four. Sharon, you are the winner. Sharon is going to play her pricing game right here in the middle of our huge stage. Thank you for the kiss, Sharon. Now you gave me a kiss, and I want to give you this—a new car. The Dodge Magnum with rear-wheel drive comes with standard equipment plus paint and fabric protection. The Dodge Magnum. Dodge Magnum. And you are going to play pocket change, and you can't play pocket change without some pocket change. There's a quarter. And for the moment, the price of that automobile is a quarter, but that's going to go up every time you make a mistake. Now, what I want you to do, I'm going to give you the first number in the price of that car. What is it, please? The first number is two. I want you to tell us the second number and the price of that automobile. Is it six, four, nine, three, or eight? Six, four, nine, three, or eight. What do you say, Sharon? Uh, eight. Eight. Is it eight? It is not eight. Raise the price of that car to fifty cents, please. Is it six, four, nine, or three? Second number in the price of that automobile. Six. Is it six, please? It is not raise that price to seventy-five cents. Now we're going to a dollar if you don't get it right this time. Four, nine, or three. Second number in the price of the car. Three. Three. How about three? Yes, you got it. Now you are right, so you can take another envelope off the board. Give it to me. We'll hope that there's some pocket change in it. Could be zero. Could be as much as two dollars. Now we're going for the third number in the price of the car. Is the third number six, four, nine, or eight? Six. It is a six. No, it is not a six. Up to one dollar for that automobile. Four, nine, or eight. Four, nine, or eight, Sharon. Nine. Is it nine? No, a dollar and a quarter. You have only a quarter to start with. You have something here, but let's. We, we've got to get some things right here. Is the third number four or eight? Four or eight. Four. Four. We want four. No, and it's a dollar and a half to buy the car. Now I will bet you can get this right. Is the number? Th is the third number eight? Yes. Yes, it's eight. And she gets an envelope for that. Take another envelope off the board. Then you got that right. You got that right. Give me that envelope. Get back here beside me and tell me is the next number in the price of the car six, four, or nine? Four. Four. How about that? That's right. Take another envelope off that board. Things are looking better now. Things are looking better now. Now we want twenty-three thousand eight hundred forty. We we want the last number. Is it six or is it nine? Nine. Is it nine? Yes. And get another envelope off the board. Now you have twenty-five cents. The price of the car is a dollar and a half. Now let us hope there's something really big in this. Something really big. Well, I'll show it to you there at home. It is, it is a dime. Raise a dime. 
35 cents. They, we've got to do better than that. We've got to do better than that. Here is a dime. A dime. Now we have up, we're up to 45, we're still a dollar and a nickel short. Here is, what? Two dollars, please. Two dollars? What is it? Another dime. There's only one left, and we need 95 cents. 50 cents. Oh, man. I'm sorry. Thank you. Thank you. Two back. More pricing games coming up from the second half of the price is right. All right, Rich. The next name on your list, if you please. It's Sarah Ashley Zegan. Come on down. You are the next contestant on the price is right. She has to kiss everybody goodbye. And then she's coming on down. High five here and a high five there. Take your place at the other end and look at the next item up for bids in our show. It's new ladies golf equipment. A ladies golf club set with irons, woods, a putter and bag for hours of fun on the green. Sarah Ashley, what do you bid? Eight hundred. Eight hundred dollars. Rosalind. Eight fifty. Eight fifty, Edward. One thousand. One thousand, Dieta. Seven hundred. Fifteen hundred. <laughs> Is that what you said? Fifteen <laughs> hundred. No, that's not what I said. But I'll take that. <laughs> no. I... You hear what she said then? She said. She said no. That's not what I said. But I'll take that. <laughs> no. I want them to light up what you said, and we don't know. What did you say? I don't know either now. <laughs> did anybody in the audience here? Did you, Rich? Rich, Rich says you bid seven hundred dollars. Yeah, that's fine. I think so. <laughs> yeah. You're the easiest to get along with of any contestant I've ever had. Yeah. The actual retail price is twelve forty, and you win it. You are the winner, Edward. And you are going to play our next pricing game, Edward. I'm happy to meet you, too. And if you win your game, this is your reward. A folding camping trailer. Chalet's Alpine folding camping trailer. You can quickly pop up the spring-loaded roof on this 16-foot trailer and lift the A-shaped walls for an all-season camping chalet of your own. A great prize worth $11,255. Edward, you will win that prize if this mountain climber does not fall off the cliff at the top of the mountain, and he won't if you know enough about three prizes that we have over here, the first of which is what? All right, Bob, first, this two-in-one cordless hand mixer features a convenient twistable head for two power settings. Second, this rechargeable cordless men's shaver includes individual floating heads. And third, serving beverages just got more decorative with this two-and-a-half-gallon drink dispenser. Prize number one, mixer. How much? What's the price of just the mixer? $40. $40? Is the right price $40? No. Here he goes now, Edward. He'll move one step for every dollar that you missed the right price. Five. You missed it. Six. Seven. You missed it. Eight dollars. Edward, I'm getting worried. You've missed that. Twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. Fifteen. Sixteen dollars. What is the right price, Gwendolyn? It's $24. Now, you're going to have to proceed cautiously. Is What is the price of the shave? What is the price of just the shave? Fifty-five. Fifty-five dollars, is that right? No, it is not, and here he goes. Seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four. Stop! Oh, Edward, what is the right price, Gwendolyn? Thirty-nine dollars. Too bad. Thank you very much. We'll play another pricing game after you see this.